Hello everybody, this is Dr. Bob DiMaria with another episode of Ask Dr. Bob from Westlake, Ohio and Naples, Florida. Here we go. This was a very interesting question that I've never had before. Dr. Bob, for the past month, I've had the sensation of crawling ants on the upper back and upper arm shoulders. No pain, weakness, etc. What makes a person have, now listen, I'm going to articulate this, form it. That's F-O-R-M-I-C-A-T-I-O-N. My A1C is 5.9, which tends to be on the high side. She has a vegan diet, cheese only once a month, low fat, low carb, and beets. Um, she has lower liver enzymes now. I see a neurologist, want to know what the cause was. So the lower liver enzymes usually tells me someone might needs vitamin B6. So what I've seen in the past people have crawling sensation. It could be a calcium need. You're gonna to wanna to have a serum blood test done. You can even contact our office because you wanna see your calcium and phosphorus ratio. That's number one. The second is you may consider having a CBC, Charlie Bravo Charlie, with the differential and checking your eosinophils. That'd be the first step to see if you possibly could have parasites because it's very possible that the parasite could be doing that to you. So that was a very good question, by the way. Dr. Bob, is there a natural treatment to fortify the pancreas? Also a very good question. Now, in our practice, we use a neonatal, neonatal bovine glandular product to support pancreas restoration. You have the context about that. So I'd like to see your glucose and your HA1C. Dr. Bob, I was home from work and you saw me on the Marilyn Hickey show and I briefly mentioned something that was from fresh ground pepper for perfume sensitivities. It happens to be molybdenum, which is a trace mineral. Now we have two products that we use for that. You might wanna have some liver enzymes done to see if your liver enzymes are low because it might need B6. We also use a test called the FIT test for food sensitivity. So I just had someone who had a sensitivity to MSG, which really means she needs molybdenum and B6. You might wanna watch this one again. Last question, what causes depression? It's estimated 18% of the people in the United States today have depression writing a book on mental health right now. I believe stress has everything to do with it. The adrenal gland needs adrenaline. It makes adrenaline. But that adrenaline comes from tyrosine, which is a, an amino acid, and phenylalanine. Tyrosine is also used for thyroid hormone. Tyrosine is also for skin pigment. Tyrosine is a natural antidepressant. Stay tuned for more. I'm Dr. Bob DiMaria.